Hey everyone, Ivy League Gaming here, and today we're playing Raid Shadow Legends, and we have giveaways to talk about, so let's get to it. Before we get into the giveaway and I showcase this amazing account, I do want to mention that I am using a Bluestacks at the moment. Thank you to Bluestacks for sponsoring this video. It is a sponsor I use daily, which I try to only do for all of my sponsors. You guys should know that. Uh, and I really love using this for playing multiple games at the same time. So here we are on Raid. Well, on my other screen right now, we are grinding some Eternal Evolution with Bluestacks. So. Having multiple instances up at the same time, especially for different games, it's not easy to do, and this just makes it so easy. There are ways to play multiple player and players account uh, accounts at the same time, but especially you might be doing that if you're doing your referrals here. But they bogged down the computer so bad, and I've had some friends with high-end computers tell me it really struggles. So you know what, Blue Stacks here has a great feature called trim memory here. See the little thing at the bottom? It just frees up extra memory, helps clear the cache as you're going along. So it's not as uh, harmful on your system. I mean, my laptop, sometimes I feel like I could cook some eggs on it. And this helps to prevent that from happening. So I just want to give another shout out to Bluestacks. Uh, it's just a really great tool. And that's just one of the many features that helps me to keep using it on a daily basis. All right, we are here on this account for a giveaway. Big thanks to this account owner who contacted me via email. For this, uh, I love to pass on really awesome accounts to other people that can make them be their main. Oh dear, this is a fun one already. And I do want to be clear, whenever I do account giveaways, we want them to be your main account, not some alt account. We aren't giving away someone's old account to be your alt. We're not giving away old alt accounts to be your alts. That's the whole point. We want to make someone be excited and have a new main account to play with. So let me get myself out of the way here and let's take a look. This is so good. Oh my goodness. This is really nice here. So we have a plus three Black Knight, a plus two Trunda, plus two Dracomar, plus one Lydia. Don't tell me they ate their Visix. Guys, don't eat your Visixes. She's actually quite useful for a lot of content. Hopefully that's an extra Visix. But anyway, um, I wouldn't, uh, let's see, we got some awakening happening here. I see some red stars as well. Lots of awesome champions. Look at this Void Legendary Collection, guys. Obviously, we have a Lydia. They did their faction wars. We have Leorius, Tuhana Rock, Mithrala, Krisk, Tormen, Cardial, Ursuga, Solus, Ethos, a Warlord, Raglan. Oh my goodness, holy... Look at all these. Holy moly. We got a Wither onto non-voids. We got Wither Prince Kaimar, Rotos. This account is stacked. Ooh, I knew it was stacked, but they were not kidding. Zavia, Kendrafon. I'm just naming a few. We have, we do have Cupidus and Venus, guys. Oh, and then a little Necrid over there. No big deal. Uh, looks like they've done most of the fusions. I see Bivald as well. We've got a Valkyrie, a Snick Track. So some new champions in the mix here too. Lots of amazing epics as well. I know they do use a bad eater for their clan boss team they mentioned so and and they do have a sub 30 second spider 25 team so that is solid but this account was a little bit neglected he took a break for a while so there's a lot of room to grow in things like doom tower so i just wanted to call that out for a minute and yeah there's a lot of room for growth even though this account looks pretty damn stacked you can see it doesn't look like we have a romantu yet either right or did i miss him i don't see romantu nope so we're still trying to work on that romantu let's check out the vault is there oh gosh there's even more in the vault of course there is 
We have a Raf Matab. I see a Harvest Jack. Another two Hanarak. All right, all right. I see you in tons more epics in the vault. Holy Skull Crowns and Seers. Geomancer. You definitely have a Geomancer for every key of Hydra. Plus your key for the Iron Twins. Solved. <laughs> We have Venomage, oh my goodness, Extra Seekers, Tyrell, Magnar, so many really great champions here. This is really stacked, and looks like they have their Faction Guardians pretty full with rares, but that's not necessary, guys. Don't necessarily overdo your rare Faction Guardians only for the factions you actually really use your rares for. And over to the reserve vault, we have even more legendaries. It just keeps it keeps going. It just keeps coming. Brachus, another ethos. Yoshi, Sato, Nethril. We have a Demitha here. Ooh, a Cavalax. I didn't even notice that there's multiple Cavalax here. That could be fun. Skull Crusher. And again, more rares, it looks like, for Faction Guardians. So this account is amazing. Like, this is just a solid account. And they're only level 88. So I'm actually surprised by how stacked their account is. They're only level 88. We've got a pretty looking gray haul over here. Got a solid go here. For sure. Let's see where they are in progress missions. Oh yeah, working toward that final steps of Romantu. So lots of progress to be had with the Doom Tower, they said, because they only did a little. And I'm not so sure about those Hydra. I think they said they stopped before Hydra. Or at some point during the start of Hydra. And so there's probably some growth for building your nice Hydra teams as well. And you definitely have the champions to do so. This account, looking at this account and looking at the player power, uh, I'm assuming this account is going to have no trouble with a very easy one key Nightmare Hydra as well. So this is a super mega whale account, I guess you could say. It is absolutely nuts. It's so, so good, guys. This is so good. I don't want to say whale account because that doesn't... Just because this account is well stacked, it doesn't mean the guy spent a lot. That's for sure. You can get legendaries by luck. You can get them by grinding out all those fusions. And you know how it goes. All right, and we're on to account number two. So this one is another proper account with email connected that we can switch the email so there should be no issue for you changing everything to your information so you could do your own two-factor authentication or properly be linked for support in the future. Um, I mentioned that because there's a couple others I'm going to show next that we cannot do that for, but we'll get to there. But first we have Necrit, of course, Ultimate Death Knight, and Zavia. So this account is a level 47, so it's a pretty high level, but it's not super, none of these uh, next few accounts are super progressed, but they're quite nice accounts that might be an awesome boost for someone. So Necrit and Zavia, hell yeah, that's just an amazing start. We've got, let's see, Steel Skull, Loria, Senecia, Basher, um, Fellhound, got level 60, Cal. Uh, we have Soul Bond save. I like it. There's a Cold Heart on this account already. A Bellower as well. I see Reliquary Tender and a Renegade down there too. So this is a nice start um, to an account. Lots of champions saved. Some food ready here. And don't forget some of the great uncommons that you guys can use like Armager, uh, Satyr, and of course my favorite Shield Guard. Um, but... Yeah, this uh, this is really nice. So we've got oh, we've got two cold hearts. We've got two cold hearts and well, two ren. I always save two renegades too, guys, because some cases late game. Well, I mean, you could get them later game too, but in some cases you want to build one renegade super strong to do harder content like waves and doom tower. In other times you want renegade to just do recycle through her skills and then die once you get to the boss, like dragon. So you can always save two renegades. Uh, and yeah, this is the account number two. Let's go on to account number three. All right, and here we have account number three. Now, this one is only level 19 with really no account work. You're just getting some really great champions. So it looks like they logged in, they started going, and then they never played. But they logged in enough to get the login champions, which is funny. Or the, yeah, that's... 
This account definitely was completely neglected, so there's tons of progress, but you'd be starting with quite a jump start. You have Cardial, Ninja, Visix, Deliana, Ultimate Death Knight, Simple, Sylv the Drakes, Cleo, and then we have Berengiri, Achok, there's a Doom Priest already, um, Carlinia, Taurus, there's some really good champions here. Um, Cargon. It looks like for Voids, we have Bellhound and Bellower already. Dagger. So not so bad here. But this account, disclaimer, does not have a real email address connected to it. It was connect created with a, like a randomly typed in email address, unfortunately. So with this, you have a login, you have a password. You can change the password through playing and play and whatnot. But you're not going to be able to ever change the email, which also means you cannot turn on two-factor authentication and you cannot actually use Plarium for support in the future. So please keep that in mind. That may not matter to you, especially if you're someone who's free to play. You shouldn't, you know, you're not as worried about money invested um, but, or you just don't care. You just know you got the login and you're going to be good from there. I mean, let's be honest, I've never needed to use support in my three years of playing the game properly, so... It probably won't affect most people anyway, who really needs to use support very often. But that is a key factor. It is a disclaimer I want to mention on this account. You are stuck with the email address for the login that I give you. You cannot change it to your own, and therefore you cannot get proper support. So disclaimer number one for this account. And we have one more account very similar. But yeah, this is, this is a fun way to get started where this account has no progression at all. It's level 19, but it has amazing set of champions to play with. So if that's your cup of tea, this might be the account for you. All right, and account number four. So this is another one. I thought they were kidding when they said level two, but this account is literally only level two. This is an account that has been logged into to collect champions, but never actually played. So please keep that in mind again. This has the same disclaimer of this is does not have an email address that's actually one that can be logged into. So you're kind of stuck with the email address as the login and you won't be able to do some stuff like two factor authentication and such. But again, you're you're logging in. You got all the login champions. We got Visix, Sil of the Drakes, Simple. Um, let's see. And of course, the other logins as well. And then we also have a Longbeard. And it looks like we've gotten a Lore already, a Tyrell, a Fane, and let's see, do we have any interesting... Okay, not so much on the Void Rares on this account. Dilgo's okay. War Maiden saved, Fleshmonger. There's some decent champions here, though. Gnarlhorn, um, and of course, lots of Rares for future fusions. But this account is another one that is a nice start for someone who wants to feel like they started day one, because this is literally a level two account. I'm not kidding. Level 2, no play, just logged in to collect stuff. So if you want to have that sort of aspect of, I have more toys to play with, but I still have to do the whole grind myself, this is the account for you as well. So this is account number 4. Account number 4, I'm just doing some screenshots so I don't forget. I forgot to screenshot the last one, but I can do that from the video. But we have one more account that I'm going to mention for this, but there also might be a bonus account number six that is another high, high level account. If that person gets back to me before the Friday stream, it'll be a bonus surprise. If not, well, it is what it is. We're also going to tell you how to enter. Just hang tight. And account number five, this is our final account I'm going to mention, that we're looking to find a home for. Uh, Tyrell, Rector, we have a Harris at level 60. She can help with that grind. Uh, we have Achak, Vrask, Ultimate Death Knight, of course. And this is it. This is an early account. This was a well-grinded account, though. This person did a really good job actually playing their accounts while doing their, like, I think, referral grind, let's be honest. And they actually got a lot of Relentless gear along the way, I noticed. So that's really cool to see that um, the Relentless gear on this account is actually there. And on the other accounts we already found homes for. But this is the final one that we're still looking to find a home for. 
this would be a great starter account for someone who wants a little bit of a boost to get grinding. So this one has less champions, but has grinded more, as you can see. At least they're going to have, this is going to have better gear than those last couple, but less amount of champions to play with. So there's a little bit of something for everyone. The last few accounts are probably good for someone brand new to the game, or for someone who's looking to return, a gift for someone that you want to get playing alongside you. Uh, yeah, but... I hope we can find homes for all these accounts. As always, guys, I say this as a disclaimer, please never enter any of my account giveaways without uh, planning to use these accounts as your main accounts. We are not giving away alt accounts to be someone else's alt account. So for you, they're like, oh, this is just a side account. My main account's better than this. Well, fine. Let's save these for someone who actually needs them and has a little bit more value for them, right? That is the goal, at least. So we want to find, even if it's just a brand new player or someone who's been watching, seen raid commercials and wants to check it out, and they want to start off with something fun. So, you know, even a brand new player that's never played before, this is kind of ideal for those kind of people. But uh, yeah, there's I love passing on these accounts. So they get some love. Um, this account has its own Gmail login, so this one's okay. This has a special Gmail and like, the same login information. So you actually have the full email and the login for the game that you can change and do whatever you want with for this account. So this has the option at least. So how do we enter? How do we enter for all of these account giveaways? What I'm going to do is tomorrow during my stream live on Twitch, we are going to do the account giveaways live on Twitch. So stay tuned there. And that's going to make the most sense. Um because it's just simpler you know it's simpler i have i have done um a bunch of giveaways for these big crack and crazy legendary accounts through youtube specifically so i'm trying to do some live on twitch at least when i do things live on twitch we kind of have a little bit more communication in the moment so what i'll do is i'll showcase all of the accounts and i'll do different marble marble races throughout the stream so you have to be there live on twitch to enter i try to make things fair i try to break things up i try to do some things on twitch some things on youtube some things on discord and for this set of giveaways we're just going to do them all on twitch that way whoever wins marble races gets first dibs on what works best for them or if you win and you want to get it for your friend your relative whatever you can pick which best fits your situation we'll cross them off the list and we'll go on to the next and do some more marble races so throughout the entire stream tomorrow we're going to be giving stuff away and yeah i'm looking forward to it so stay tuned for more um i always love passing on these accounts this is really cool and yeah let's give these accounts some love please don't be that person that wins an account and then never plays it though if that ever happens to you and you're like i'm guilty i completely ignored the account i won and you want to re-gift it on, please let me know in the comments below. D or not even in the comments below. DM me on Discord. We can find a we can rehome your account again if we need to. So try not to let that happen. And if you are someone who has some accounts sitting around because you like to try playing alt accounts, but it becomes too much, let me know. I'm always happy to pass on these accounts, even if it's every damn week. Let's do it. Let's give away accounts every week and keep these circulating and let new people have fun with something that maybe they were maybe they've had bad luck and at least these accounts have a little bit better rng for the start so there's always something for everyone when it comes to these account giveaways but that's all for now thank you guys um for watching sorry this was a bit of a long video but there was a lot to show on that first account so i tried to be thorough and talk it through hopefully we have a surprise account to give away as well Oh, and actually, I'm going to be doing some gem giveaways this weekend, too. So we have lots of things to give away. So stay tuned on YouTube for my next gem giveaways. My next ones will be done through YouTube. So don't worry, you can still win some free stuff directly through YouTube and via my Discord. So stay tuned for that.